Hey guys, it is Code Draco, and I'm here to give all you graphic designers out there a quick, useful tip. Well, recently I've been really trying to improve my skills and expand as a designer. So, I've been looking up on lots of design websites and watching lots of more advanced tutorials, you know, Grayscale Gorilla, stuff like that, and like, you know, just some some more professional advanced design websites and stuff, you know, just to, you know, improve and learn things. And one problem that I as a designer, and I'm sure if you are an experienced designer or you're into this as far as I am, which I've been into this for a while now, you have a ton of well one of the most important things that you know in design are fonts of course typography fonts that type of thing is so important and one of the things I bet you have a lot of are fonts now here's the thing I have over 2,000 fonts right now and yesterday I had over 5,000 and what I did is I'm slowly going through them and deleted them and that's what I was doing and I realized this is taking way too long as you can see I can go click up here go to fonts preview delete it takes like a whole minute for all of them to load and it takes forever to delete like all of those so what I did is I looked up how professional designers figure this problem out and I I learned how they use font managers so I downloaded one that I thought was really good and I'm gonna recommend it all to you guys and show you what it is right here is what it is it's called Nexus font let's click on it and start it up as you can see it's gonna very quickly very very quickly load all my fonts and not only it does it all, all load my fonts the actual Windows app that uses it to load all the fonts loads the fonts and it doesn't even show this but this one shows a nicely clean interface showing all of my fonts and previews so as we can see I have all these fonts and right now I have 2200 fonts and I only went through A and B and deleted ones I didn't think I would ever use now as you can see there's all these fonts and it's a really Mac type of interface but still all of these fonts it's very quick and very sleek now the good thing about this that you might wondering why would I need this if you're a designer this is just so useful I can't even I can't even explain it alright well I'll try to okay let's skip to just like the middle here as you can see I'm on G which is over here you know middle so let's say alright this font right here and this font right here and this font right here I am never going to use these fonts in my life so what I do is I go up here and I go to uninstall and I uninstall them and you say yes and now they're gone you can do that to as many fonts as you want and you can just quickly and cleanly instead of saying there going to cinema and if you go to cinema 40 or photoshop or illustrator you open up your fonts first of all it takes like a whole minute for all of them to load second of all it takes forever to find a good one if you don't already know what font you want you're just browsing it takes forever it takes a whole, it takes just 30 seconds or 45 seconds to get out of like get through just a couple because there's so many fonts this is so useful you can delete a bunch you can organize them clean up your font collection this is so useful to any designer if you if you're a designer you know like how much of a necessity this is. Another useful thing that we have here are sets. I can add a new set and let's say I can add um let's see sans serif and I can add all right here sans serif and I can add all my favorite sans serif sets. So let's reopen my installed fonts and let's go to search let's say uh Babus. I can add it right here and then you see it's quick, it doesn't stop for anything. I can add it real quick tall dark right here is another sans serif font and you know it's just such a nice easy you know way to organize and set my fonts and then now if ever maybe I'm in Cinema 4D and I'm thinking hmm uh, there was a really nice font that I was you know using the other day and I put it into a set and let's just check it out click on sans serif or whatever set you're using and then right and then wait one second <laughs> and then wait so let's say you really want to know a font that was they're using. You click on the collection that you just made. And you can see, oh wait, that font was knockout. And then you type it in and you get it. It's such a nice way to organize, clean up, and set your fonts. And that's such a useful thing for any designer. And I'm sure you guys know that. 
Well, uh, thanks for watching, guys, and I hope you guys find this as useful as I find it. And uh, I'll put a link to the website where you can download this in the description. It's super easy to use, super easy to catch on to, and I hope you guys uh, find as much use as I do. Thank you.